America is a 22 ounce bottle. This is the 32 ounce bottle. And they have a metal double insulated bottle that you could get for free right now if you buy 10 flavor cartridges. What a steal. No, it's not a steal, it's free. Oh. <laughs> All right, that's gonna block a lot of wind. And with our new door in place, we also hung up this huge tarp, which will allow us to keep all the heat from the fireplace inside our shelter. Oxygen comes in, fire burns, sends heat in the room, sends smoke out. This is redneck engineering at its finest. And finally, after being cold for so long. All right. Look at that. And we have a fire. I can feel the heat coming out. We Jimmy rigged this up with like ruins from an abandoned city. Anyway, go to drinkcircle.com slash MrBeast or scan the QR code on his face if you want to order Circle right now. This is the final room. We have plenty in the corner. We have our beds that are now smaller. Tell me this isn't genius. This is Mark's iPad in the TV frame. Obviously some nice lighting, a furnace that is heating up the room, a real table with chairs, and a shelving unit with the scraps of food we have left and the dirty towel we've been sharing. This is survival. But just as our night was going so well, for the fifth day in a row, we heard broken glass. Mark, I'm right here, dog. What was that? Man, we were having such a good day too. I wanna go see who's upstairs. I'm carrying the knife as a threat, but I'm not gonna use it. <laughs> hey, if you're up here, just come out. I wanna be best friends with you. Are you serious you're not pranking me? Bro, I swear to you, it was not me. Hello. What is this? What? Oh my gosh. This is the most Mark Rover thing I've ever seen. <laughs> what the heck? You swore! So turns out Mark was pranking us and he was the one dropping bottles this whole time. I've got a remote control here, but no one suspects it. I can put in my sleeping bag and I can start launching glass bottles from the roof. Freak everyone out. Oh my gosh. I thought I could trust you. Boom. Now that Mark's not pranking me, we re-rigged his contraption. He smells me. Here you go. I'll take one. I got one as well. That's yes. kind of cool. <laughs> To be honest, it was pretty easy to forgive Mark because we only had one day left in the challenge. Good morning. Good morning, abandoned city. Abandoned city. Abandoned city. It's so much colder out here than it is in there. Let's go back. It's now the morning of day six. All the modifications we did were phenomenal. And it was at least 10 degrees warmer. Yep. That was amazing. Slept incredible. Mark, on our last real day, I say we go have some fun. Jimmy, is that a kayak? I know we should do 